Okay, what do you say? What do you know? Well, team, today we're uh, reviewing some magic, but not just the magic. I'm reviewing the spectators. I'm reviewing the audience here, okay? If you're watching a magic trick, I'm watching you. Let's see how we did. Let's go! Okay, this is obviously a sketch. I mean, I, don't, I mean, I don't know if they're selling it like a sketch, but this is a sketch. Like, this is set up all day. Uh, I mean, still kind of fun to watch, but that's... Come on. Oh, I got the old lemons under the cup thing. Yeah. These ones are always so hard to tell if they're real or not. <laughs> Seems so dumb. Look at this guy. Got He's got the ball on his head. Like you don't know. Come on, lady. You're not going to look up? I mean... Come on. You're not going to look at his head? See, this trick would have... That trick would have been better at the end had she looked up and noticed him, okay? Because I've done that with card tricks before. You lick the back and stick it to your forehead, and you keep doing the card trick, and they don't notice for a long time, but eventually they look up at you, and they're like, ah, oh, there's a card. They should. Come on. If you're going to do that video, if you want me to believe it at the end, she's got to look up and see it. Come on. All right, look at this. As she pours it, it gets less and less. This video is shot in reverse, um, 100%. And I like a good reverse shot, I really do. Um, yeah, it's dope. She handled that pretty well. She, she did it pretty good. Because you, you really have to twist the way your brain works to shoot something in reverse. Because you got to walk in, like, she had to start surprise. Oh, you know, but that, that clips in reverse. Uh, looks kind of neat though. If you're not suspicious already for things being in reverse a little bit, that can fool your eye for quite a while, so. Yeah, looks good. A lot of that lately. People really doing the camera edits. Uh, here's another camera edit going through the wall like that. So, okay. <laughs> Let's watch this. How does it end? Yeah, okay. <laughs> this was done okay. It's fun to look at, but this is just a, uh, the camera edit. On my TV show, Big Trick Energy, we actually did one of our cold opens just like this on episode two. Uh, except we didn't use a camera edit. Uh, we did it for real, and that's why I love this, because it's the same idea. This is just done by, like, cut and mask. It's just a camera cut. But we did it on Big Trick Energy for real. Check that out right here. See, we had the, the fake piece there. Look at that reveal. Come on! So good. But the fact that they thought of this is pretty cool. Danny Garcia was the one who designed that trick for us. And before he mentioned it, I never would have thought of it. But these guys thought of something very similar. So, gotta give props to that. For sure. So this idiot steals a rock and puts it in his pocket. And then she uses this opportunity to take a rock, put it in her purse, pretend it's a magic trick, and show that the rock's in his pocket. Okay. Why the hell is he sticking around? Okay, it, you know what I mean? Like she, she pieces out after. So if he'd already stole his rock, you take off. Okay, just go, man, don't stick around. That's how you know that's bullshit, but I love the idea because it's really clever and funny and I, I, I can work with that. I might, I might expand on that in my life and try something with that because that's a fun idea, but uh, he should take it off. But here is the bigger question. Why the hell are you selling rocks? This is great. So she's helping this guy put his clothes away. He's counting his moolah out, goes stick it in his pocket. <laughs> she puts the pants up in a pocket. That is some sneaky shit, lady. That is some sneaky shit, and I love it. <laughs> that's that's great. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I dig that move. I don't think it would really work, but uh, A plus for effort, that's great. I, I wish that was real. I really do. Oh, sleight of foot. This sneaky lady! Oh, I'm watching that again. Okay, this is great. Check this out. She's like, oh yeah, look look up here. Look straight up for no reason. Just up there, look up there. I'm gonna use my toe to grab your pork chop. Ha! Ah, what's the pork chop? What? Gah! You better wash your feet if you're gonna be pork chopping it. Foot grab the pork chop, bring it around, then eating it. And what are you pointing at? What are you pointing at? What is this? What? 
What? You're pointing straight up. Where's the sky? The ceiling. This is where heaven is. Waiter, look at my finger. I do respect the sleight of foot. That is some sneaky shit. I like that. But what is this? This is nothing. You might you might as well just be like, oh crap, a, a grizzly bear. Because at least he'll turn around. If he turns around, just reach over and grab the pork chop with your hand. Oh, what an idea. But I respect the sleight of foot. I respect it. Where'd she do with it? What'd she do with the sleight of foot? Just gonna hold out in your foot like that? <laughs> where are you gonna go from there? How are you gonna get it up to you? Okay. You know what? Good job on the sleight of foot. I just, I gotta leave it at that. I'll leave it at that. What am I doing? I'll leave it at that. Oh, damn. Look at this. This is like, check this out. Okay, so this is like, ooh. This is nice video editing. I mean, th this isn't real magic. This isn't what I do. This is like some Zach King style shit. This is like, oh man, I really like it. But, uh, yeah, it's not, you know, that's not real, like, real magic, you know what I'm saying? It's not like, it's not like a sleight of hand. You can learn that that's all in the camera, that's all in the edit, which is so fun to watch. Not really my area of expertise, but I love it. I mean, I can obviously spot it. Uh, wouldn't that be cool if you could really do that, though? Just, like, vanish like that? Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, man, look at this guy. He's dropping glasses already. Okay, this is my kind of magician. He's got my kind of sleight of hand skills. You know you're getting down to the business of magic when you got your hard hat on. What you got for me, buddy? Let's go. Uh, he's right down there. Very serious. Pouring out a cup to another cup. Why not? No! Oh! I don't know. I don't know how that works. If that is not a camera trick, I don't know how that works. That is so good. <laughs> Unless it's a camera trick, then you fooled me, sir. Hey, playing girl. Oh, okay. That was happen quick, hey? What's going What the hell is... Okay. So he's got ripped up cards. He's got like card torn into four pieces. Let's look at that. Okay. Yeah, four pieces. And then he throws it and it turns into one card on his cat. It's card to cat. Card to cat. Card to cat. Why? <laughs> Do it on table. Why are you doing the cat? You must have done it just so I'd ask. Okay, good job. I love it. I don't I don't know. That was a good one for sure. These are real spectators. You can tell already. Sometimes magic spectators seem fake, because they are. Sometimes they seem fake just because magic brings out a weird thing in people, and sometimes people do just like freak out, and they or, or or they do get fooled by something that, that, that on camera you might deem too simple, or had they not see that or something. Sometimes you at home you go, no way that can really happen. And sometimes magic just can be that good. And other times it's totally fake, and your suspicions are right. Uh, but these people, just the way it's shot and the way they're standing, this is real people, which I like. Oh, the haunted deck action. Yeah, that's about right. Okay. I don't like the camera guys missing the reaction. There they go. Yeah, that's normal people's reaction. One guy clapping, a couple people laughing. <laughs> this is a this trick. <laughs> okay. Oh, look at that. Look at look at look at Indiana Jones back here. This is great. <laughs> Who knew Harrison Ford uh, didn't age so well, hey? <laughs> this guy does magic like I do. Uh, the technique's not exactly perfect, but uh, he's aiming for the right response. And look at these laughing, smiling people. That's all you can ask for. That's great. <laughs> My two friends, Pepper and Orbax, they're uh, not magicians. They're like sideshow guys. Here's Orbax pulling a truck with the hooks coming out of his back. Look at those clowns. Look at those clowns in the back. The hell? <laughs> Why? Oh, let's not look at the rest of this. He's got hooks in his back. Let's watch a different Pepper and Orbax clip here. <laughs> Orbax is dropping a ping pong ball onto Pepper's head with mouse traps and ping pong balls all around. Just for no reason. <laughs> let's watch it because why not? These guys do stuff and when they do it, they do it for real and I love it. Oh, that's a cool chain reaction. Uh, this looks awesome. Again, this has nothing to do with magic, but come on. Tell me in the comments, would you or would you not want to try this? I, it doesn't look like it's going to hurt. I think it'll just be freaky and loud and ta -ta 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 -ta. I love it. <laughs> Pepper Space! <laughs> oh, well, let's just run out the clock on this one. I think that's it for today's video. Uh, let me know if you would actually want to try this. Please like the video if you liked it. And uh, if not, like it anyways. Why not? Why should we both be disappointed? You know what I'm saying? And please subscribe. And I will see you guys next week or in a couple days or whenever I post again, but it won't be long. It won't be long. Thanks so much for coming out. Enjoy whatever's left of your day. This coffee's cold now. <laughs>